This is a position to work on strength and lateral stability. I like this because it kind of works from the stretch position of another movement I like. So I'm going to come to this side set where I just start off on two knees. I let my hand come to the side and I basically sit on my one hip. My legs just kind of fall right on top of each other. I spread my fingers nice and wide, right? And I try to push down into the floor. Now, as I sit here, my hips are in a little bit of flexion, meaning that there's a little bit of like an indent here, like I'm sitting in a chair. So what I'm gonna do is, as I push into the ground, I'm gonna extend my hips. So you see my belt buckle comes forward, okay? So level one would be just doing that, coming back down to where my butt comes back and I sit on my butt, and my hips come forward as I push up. Level two would actually be lifting this leg, okay? So I could keep this leg up the whole time, as I come up and down, okay. I could stay up here and I could do lifts from my hip. I tend to mix in a little bit of both. So I might come down and come up and then I might pause here and do five and then I might do it again. And then I could just easily transition other side and the floor, oh, I'm not gonna pull over. Same thing, I come from Crease to my hips, butt behind me, to really trying to extend, really trying to get my back straight, my chest up tall. Maybe I work on that first. I try to make sure when I push into the ground, I drive my shoulder down away from my ear. And then maybe I add lift to my hips. You'll notice I put my hand on my pelvis because I don't want this to move. I don't want my pelvis to sink this way. And then maybe if I want to, I might keep this the whole time and work on the bottom leg. Maybe I might throw it at the top doing five to 10 lifts. Really watching that I don't hike my pelvis.